Hi, I'm Sarah, manager of Shoalhaven Libraries. Um, we all love our jobs and love working in libraries and we wanted to ask you guys what you thought about us too. So um, I hope you enjoy this short film with um, just a few little stories that we've um, collected from you guys. Hello, welcome to Sanctuary Point Library. This is our lovely little library branch. We're also known in the community as, amongst the kids as the Little Blue Library. Um, we're like a family here. We love our borrowers. I've been here for 17 years and it really is like a family. We get very close to our borrowers and we know them really well. They all know us by name and they worry about us when we're not here. Um, and it's a great place to work and a great place for our borrowers too. Sanctuary Point Library! Yay! Hi, my name's Vicky. I'm the librarian at Ulladulla Library. The beautiful Ulladulla Library situated in the Ulladulla Civic Centre right across from the million dollar view of Ulladulla Harbour. We're very lucky in that we get to do lots of different services, not only library but tourism, civic centre functions and events as well, at least helping with that anyway. Um, and we have lots of great borrowers who hopefully will tell you great stories about their experiences here. Well I'll tell you personally why shall Haven City Council's Ulladulla Library so helpful. Um, on several occasions with deadlines to meet on a Monday morning for newspaper copy. I've had to race down here and the girls have been absolutely sensational in helping me uh, get on the internet and, and get rid of some copy with uh, all the help and assistance one could possibly have. And we th I thank them very much for that. So I've been using the Ulladulla Library since my son has been diagnosed with dyslexia. The ladies in the library are really helpful to help him get the right resources to help him with his reading. I see people come in for different reasons. I see people coming in to study. I see people coming in to um, use the computers. I see people come in to borrow books for assignments. I see um, high school students in here. I see. Um, parents and their children in the kids area. So for me, it um, caters to everybody. What I use this for is uh, an escape. It's my window on the, the social world. It's also an engagement place where I meet other people and talk about other things. It's a place where information is exchanged. It's the only place where I can find information on the uh, strategic plan from the council or various other documents that are put out in hard copy on the reference shelves here. I like coming to Ulladulla Library because of the books and the computer and everything. Hello, I'm Naomi. This is Milton Library. This is where I've worked for 24 years and I just love it. We've got a vibrant, passionate community. Our library's now open three days a week. We've got all sorts of people coming through. We've got artists and children and folk from the retirement village. Um, it's my town. It's the most beautiful building. It's 1871. We've got one of the few arched window libraries in New South Wales. Um, it's part of me, it's part of my community, and I'm thrilled to still be here. When we moved down here, I was very happy to find a library here in Milton. Um, I spent the first four years of my time here in Milton uh, coming into a library fairly frequently because my wife was um, suffering the sort of end times of Parkinson's. Uh, she was unable to read for herself anymore and uh, she enjoyed me reading to her. In this day and age now where we're all just apparently run off our feet and we're all faced with technology so much, it is just a pleasure to walk off the wonderful Milton High Street and walk into this library and just go, what a place. We have uh, special education students from kindy through to year six and we've been accessing the library on a weekly basis. Naomi here has been fantastic. She's running some great programs that are really benefiting our kids. It, we have a school library, but it's, um, it's just really different to have such a nice community space to, to make those connections with the community. Hi, I'm Robin. Welcome to Nara Library. 
This is a really bustling and dynamic space where lots and lots of things happen all the time. People use this library for many different reasons. They attend classes, they browse the shelves, they come to an author talk, they might attend children's programs. Whatever the reason, we don't mind. We love having people here and we aim to deliver top quality service. Shoalhaven Library's Local Heritage Collection is a popular resource for anyone researching this area. The collection contains unique resources, including over 100 years of local newspapers. I've been researching and writing local history for many years, and I've extensively used the microfilms of the old newspapers here in the library. And uh, even though the Trove website provides a lot of those things today, it's, it's not a perfect thing and it doesn't have all of the newspapers we've got here. So, so I'm here most days. I've usually got a, three or four research projects on the go and I'm always using the film to, uh, to search for things when I've got a particular day to, in association with Trove. I've attended um, a number of the family history sessions and I found the handouts that they uh, left us with were particularly interesting and also enabling um, our use of the Ancestry.com. Our children's events and programs promote the joy and the value of reading for our youngest members of our community. My hands are clapping, clapping, clapping. As family daycare educators, we enjoy bringing the children to the library for story time to build on their language and literacy skills and get out and about in the community. Yeah, it also gives us a variety of um, material that uh, the kids are exposed to and can learn from. And especially the book week, that performance is always so much fun. I absolutely love that one. Hi, each month we deliver to over 90 of our library members who depend on our home library service for their reading material. And I must say that the happiest visitor I ever have is the librarian who comes up the stairs with a smile, carrying books that I have requested. And the library, librarians in that department, they really go out of their way to get books of my choice. And it's really wonderful, yes. Some people just come to the library because it's a safe and welcoming place. I come here Wednesday afternoons for about uh, two hours until my bus goes again and uh, it, it, it's lovely, it's uh, cool in, in, in summer and nice and warm and uh, comfy in, in winter and like I feel safe here and it is a bit like a family because I live here now since 21 years and this is how long I uh, have come here to the library. Because I like reading books about crime scene books and things like that. Because I like reading books about prison sheriff books. I love coming to the book library to read art books books on detective thrillers and everything. I do. And I also love to read books because they inform you on things too, which is the best. The Mobile Library visits outlying villages, schools, preschools and retirement homes. This service is often a lifeline to people who are unable to access their services any other way. It's great! It's awesome! It's great! We just never manage without it. Bob and I don't even get into town or anything. Bob particularly is, has a lot of trouble moving around. And uh, no, we just, we just don't go out, so we'd have no opportunity of getting all that way. You can get books uh, and uh, you can uh, get whatever you want without spending your money. Shoalhaven Libraries have volunteers every single day. They help us out with things like covering books, returning books to the shelves and general customer service. Without these volunteers, 
I don't know what we do. They're a great help and we really enjoy having them. I feel greatly privileged that I can come and volunteer and help out here because it's so great that, that people can come here and read and learn and spend time in a safe environment and our librarians, we're blessed with very creative, a wonderful bunch of people here that keep this place ticking over very nicely for the community. We're so lucky to have it and um, great resource. I encourage everybody to use it and I love to be here. We offer many ways to learn about technology, including one-on-one -on -one tuition, group sessions and online courses. I have just uh, finished a, a, a lesson with, on one-on-one -on -one at the Shoalhaven Library and, and I find that the system is excellent. Uh, I was a, an amateur with a new program on a computer, although I had worked computers previously, and I found that I had great assistance uh, from the instructors uh, in, in this. It, it's very valuable, this system. I suppose the best part is that like people with disabilities like me that find it very hard to be able to think clearly and just to do different things, that things like this are offered to help people like us with disabilities to be able to try and get on with life and, and do technology and do things and be able to live a normal life. Through partnerships we can offer innovative literacy programs. We've been coming to the library to, um, to access the Paws and Tails program and it's undoubtedly been one of the best things that we've done for my daughter and it's helped her with her reading, um, improved her confidence and it's one of the things that she really loves to do. Good girl. Hi, at Shellhaven Libraries we have some amazing activities. We have book sales, book clubs, author talks and even movie screenings. I've been involved with the book club here uh, and then coming to the, the events where the author talks and, and particularly last night with Kate Forsyth was just absolutely brilliant. A big thank you to everyone who contributed. We think you're awesome and because we think you're awesome we'll give the last word to you guys. Thanks. Well I really don't know what I'd do without books. To me, they're like breathing, they keep me going. <laughs> uh, however, the other thing about the library is it's where people meet and happen to frequent. It's one of those places which is the social exchange. I think it's like almost like a family. It's really nice. So, uh, uh, you know, I'm happy that the library exists. We are the mobile library. Uh, so it means, you said, explain what it means to you. Well, it means a hell of a lot. It's the most precious resource, I think, in the Shoalhaven. I found the library and I got a new lease of life. And I'd like to thank them very much too.